Nathan's on the toilet. He can actually control the direction of your inflow. This after death virtual world is so much fun. He felt hungry, so he went to the cafeteria. That table was filled with food. Nathan excitedly grabbed a plate of food. In the next moment, an announcement came from the cafeteria. Breakfast time was over. Suddenly all the food disappeared. Even the cooks and waiters disappeared. A man who also missed the breakfast ran over to the restaurant. He was helpless. But there was a way he could eat. He went to a cupboard. He opened and closed the door. Bread appeared on a plate on the table. It seemed the man had found a loophole. Nathan tried it too. And the bread appeared again. The two became fast friends. Luke warned Nathan not to go into the big pillar of light out there. It's full of data streams. Some fools tried to get back to the real world through it. But in the end, all their data was gone. That's what piqued Nathan's interest. He ignored the guardrail's warning. He went inside. Luckily, his system administrator spotted him in time to dissuade him from going in. 